What's the difference between a cock and a hinge? Stay tuned. Okay, you hear the terms cocking and hinging your wrist uh, all the time in golf, but what is that? It's actually two different movements, and it's important you know the difference just so you can understand a lot of the instructions you're, you're being given. Cocking means taking your wrist and moving it up toward the thumb. That's a cock. Either hand up toward the thumb is cocking your wrist. Cock, cocking your wrist. Okay, cock, uncock, cock, uncock. It's as simple as that. Think of your thumb, cock, uncock. Hinging is moving your wrist back. Hinge, it's toward the back of your hand. Hinge, unhinge, hinge, unhinge. Hinge, unhinge. Let me get it down, maybe you'll see it better there. Hinge, unhinge. Hinge, unhinge. And then cocking. Cock, uncock. Cock, uncock. Why is it important to learn these two different definitions? Because at the top of your backswing, your lead hand is going to be cocked and your trail hand is going to be hinged. It's weird that it can be do both of those, but it can. So you just go up here, top of your position. I'm going to lower it so you can see it. See, my lead hand is cocked, but the wrist is flat. There's no hinge in it at all. But it's fully cocked. If you're top of your swing position, it's cocked, and during the golf swing, it will uncock. It cocks and uncocks. Okay? When you get from here, you top of the back swing, it drops down like this, and then it uncocks. It goes up and it cocks. You've got a full cock. Your lead hand, or trail hand, excuse me, goes up to the top of the backswing position and it hinges. You see how it's bent back onto itself? It hinges. When it comes down here, when that uncocks, it unhinges. And you'll get a better view from over here. So it's hinged at the top. Your lead hand is fully cocked. So it comes down here, it's still fully cocked, still fully hinged. When it uncocks, notice it also unhinges at the same time as that head goes down. So this hand hinges and unhinges in the golf swing. This hand cocks and uncocks. It's weird that they make different movements, but they do. Can you get up to the top of your back swing? Your trail hand is hinged. It's not cocked. It's not cocked though. See, I can still cock it a little bit. It is not cocked. It's hinged back. When it comes down, as your lead hand uncocks, your trail hand unhinges. And notice the club face is closing when that happens. This is actually the moment of closing your club face. When it uncocks, it unhinges. When you flatten back out your trail, this trail hand, you square the club face. Just a little extra there for you. But you unhinge and it squares. Uncock, unhinge, squares up. That's the difference between cocking and hinging. Your lead hand cocks. Your trail hand hinges. They make different movements, but you need to learn the difference between cocking and hinging.